Hi guys, it's Andre. If you're looking to take advantage of the MagSafe features on your iPhone 12 or 13, why not try one of these two Halo Lock accessories? This is the Halo Lock magnetic wireless car charger, and this is the Halo Lock tripod mount adapter, both from ESL. And both of these products are compatible with most iPhone 12 and 13 versions, and any phone with the added Halo Lock universal ring available separately from ESL. First, let's have a look at this magnetic car charger. With most chargers, their way of holding the phone in place is to grip on the edges of your phone. With this phone holder and charger, you're able to take advantage of the MagSafe technology within your iPhone, whether that's without a case or with a MagSafe compatible case like this ESR Cloud Soft case, which I'll link to my video review up there and in description below. This will now allow you to magnetically connect your phone to the mount, which now makes it easier to put on and remove your phone with just one hand without the need of having to fumble about with the adjustable grips, while at the same time making sure that your phone is both secure and protected. And when you are traveling on a bumpy or uneven surface, your phone isn't going to suddenly remove itself from the dock. So far, I haven't found an uneven road surface, speed bump or pothole that's been able to dislodge this phone from the mount. If you want to know just how strong this magnetic attraction is, providing you're using an official MagSafe case or one of ESR's own Halo Lock cases, it is strong enough to hold the weight of six iPhone 13 Pro Maxes. Bold claim, it'd be interesting to put this to the test in a rally car, for example. So if you're watching this and you wanna take on this challenge, just let me know in the comments below. What terrain can beat an iPhone and the Halo Lock magnetic wireless car charger? This mount will mainly connect and clamp to your car via the vent, which depending on your car can either be horizontal or vertical, as the clamp itself can be rotated as required, and then securely held in place by the rest support arm, which further stabilizes the whole mount. When in place and the phone attached to it, you are able to fully adjust the phone's orientation thanks to the 360 degree ball joint, which makes transitioning your phone from portrait to landscape orientation easy and secure, with the security of those magnets always holding your phone in place no matter which angle it's held in. To ensure one touch mounting and charging with the supplied USB-A to USB-C cable plugged into the bottom of the mount you're able to also charge your phone and if you have a compatible adapter or USB socket in your car you're able to get access to fast charging as well otherwise without that fast charging adapter you're just going to get that standard wireless charging speed. I use this in my car for mounting the phone only, thanks to the great battery in the iPhone 13 Pro. But it's nice to know that when and if you do need to charge it, this can all be done quickly. So never underestimate those few seconds saved either side of your car journey when you can effortlessly put in and take out your phone. And when you're driving in a safe and legal manner, follow those road navigations which can be done easily in whichever orientation you want, compared to many grip mounts which only restrict you to portrait orientation, while giving you that peace of mind that your phone isn't going to simply fall off when you go over that speed bump too quickly. And it's all thanks to the stable and fully adjustable Halo Lock magnetic wireless car charger from ESL. Right, we can put this one down and move on to this one. So this is the Halo Lock Photography Phone Tripod Mount Adapter, which like me, if you do a lot of content creation with your iPhone, and just like the car mount before, are used to common grips that hold your phone in place, why not take advantage of the MagSafe capabilities of your iPhone with a tripod mount like this? I'm not gonna go into depth about this one like I did with the car mount, as the technologies and holding strength of the Halo Lock magnets provides exactly the same strength properties as that one, as well as the adjustment positionings around the 360 degree ball joint, allowing quick and easy access and removal of your phone from the mount. This provides a magnetic upgrade for a whole range of different mounting accessories, thanks to that quarter inch studded hole at the bottom of the mount, meaning that it's compatible with many tripods, selfie sticks, monopods, and ring lights. One of the only downsides to this mount, which I do see in many accessories that mount to the phone in the middle, particularly with my iPhone 13 Pro, even though of all the iPhone 12 and 13 series of phones that this is compatible with, the iPhone 13 Pro is the only one that it isn't fully compatible with and I'm assuming that's because of the close proximity of the mount to the lens module, resulting in when you are using the wide and ultra wide lens, you're going to get that mount in your shot, which means that you'll either have to crop it in post or zoom in. But the concept is there for other iPhones. I still find it useful and secure for everything I use it for. Due to the weight of the phone and the design of the mount, it cannot be used on its own freely standing with the phone attached. Otherwise it will obviously fall over. But there are ways around this if you're doing tabletop shots, for example, like using various attachments 
attachments or even using a mini tripod. As mentioned earlier, those few seconds that products like these shave off every time you use them and the convenience and variety that MagSafe brings to your iPhone, whether it be through accessories that help or add to your experience. I will leave links to both of these ESR products in the description below. So if you want to see what I think of this Halo Lock case that makes the connection so strong and is much more cost effective compared to Apple's own MagSafe cases, then check out this video when you finish this one. And if you have enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. That's all for me today. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.